hi guys you are welcome to my youtube channel today i'll be showing you how you can configure your start pro after installation before you start working with it before you start using your um, start pro to model analyze and then design okay you need to um, configure it so when you look at the um, at the left here you can see the project task you have the new project you have open project and the fourth one is configuration so click on configuration and then you will see um, a lot of things you can change here. First, you can go to the global axis orientation. You know you have two type of axis orientation. You have the global axis orientation and you have the local axis orientation. Okay. For the global axis orientation, you have two options. You can decide to make your Y axis to be vertical and you can also make your Z axis to be vertical. Okay. So if you want your vertical to be Y, then you can say Y is up. But if you want vertical to be Z, then you can say Z is up. Okay, so I'll pick Y is up. All right. So this depends on what you need. So uh, after you are done doing that, um, if you want to change your background color as well, you know, um, if you want, usually I use white for my background color. But if you want um, a black background color, you can pick it. Let's decide to pick um, black. Okay, then you can go to base units. Okay, so if you want to use the metric or you want to use the English, English is the um, the the imperial okay but if you want to use the si which is metric you can pick on um, the metric all right you can also go to um working directory to change where you want um your your files to be saved okay so this is where your files will be saved if you want to change this you can also um do that another thing you can configure is the um the design code the default design code so you can go to start default design code when you click on this, then you are going to see um, several um, designs that the Start Pro can do. So you select a default design code for them. So for the steel design, you can see steel design. I have chosen BS 5400. If you want to use um, Euro code or any kind of code you want to use, you can definitely pick it here. Okay, so that will be the default. And then for the um, concrete, I've been using BS 8110 for the um, default. You have many more. Okay. For the aluminium, this is what you, I'm using. There is only one code. And then for the um, timber, you have four code. You can pick one, all right? So let me pick Euro code. And then for the design, uh, for the shear wall, that is still a concrete. So I'll be using the 8110. You can decide to use um, any you wish, okay? So just click on apply so that I can configure. Font color for all label will be set to default. So click on OK and then accept. So this is the first thing you need to do after you've installed your Start Pro V8i. Watch out for the next video where I'll be introducing you to the interface of Start Pro V8i. If you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, ensure you subscribe and then you need to click on the bell icon so that you can see my notifications whenever I post a new video. Thanks for watching.